Hey, Hong Yan. Oh, hi, Yao. I'm here. All right, you know, Siftis is about to start. There are so many highlights this year. Have you figured out how to report it? Of course. Let me show you. Hello, everyone. Siftis will officially open today. Siftis refers to China International Fair for Trade in Services, a major platform for trade in services in China. This year, it's to be held from September 2nd to September 7th, and will have an exhibition area of 130,000 square meters. Well, that's true, but it seems too boring. Anything special this year? You're right. How about this one? A theme toward digital future and service-driven development, the trade fair will feature a special section for digital services for the first time. More than 10,000 enterprises from 153 countries and regions have signed up for this year's CITES. Among them, 2,400 firms will showcase their products and services offline. Ah,、uh, much better. The theme of digitalization is very clear this time. But amid the pandemic, people may be more worried about whether、mm-hmm. China can run such a large-scale event safely. No worries. See this. In order to protect people's health, all unvaccinated people with a negative nucleic test certificate within 48 hours are allowed to participate. In addition, everyone has to measure their body temperature when entering the venues and wear masks throughout the event. Moreover, not only the epidemic prevention requirements for people are high, but also the facilities. Key locations will go through the environmental monitoring nucleic acid test every two days. Door handle checked, faucet checked, elevator checked, bathroom checked. So, how's it going over there? Yeah, Hong Yan. Right now, I'm at the Shougang Park venue for Siftis. This is the first time that this venue is used for Siftis. And what's special about this place is that it used to be a steel factory site, but now it's being renovated into the headquarters of the Beijing Winter Olympic Organizing Committee, as well as the competition venue for the big air events. So it's a very unique combination of the historic industrial element and the Winter Olympics element, as well as a modern services trade show. So besides the themes of the recurring services like sports, culture and tourism, education, IT and finance, this year's fair will also have exhibitions on new topics such as healthcare services, business services, engineering and construction services. Well, I'm going to prepare for an interview. See you later.